Hi everyone, in today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use Instagram on iPhone. Watch the video till the end and don't forget to subscribe to our channel by hitting that subscribe button. Press the notification bell so that you'll never miss another upcoming upload from us. If you are a beginner on Instagram and you'd like to learn how to use your Instagram on iPhone, then here's how to do it. Simply open up your app store from your iPhone and in the search bar, search for Instagram and perform your search. Soon after you find the Instagram application, which looks like this, tap on the download button to begin the downloading process. Instagram is a social media platform that places a strong emphasis on uploading photos and videos throughout its mobile application. As long as your account is public, you are able to capture, modify and post visual content for both followers and non-followers by sharing, saving, commenting and liking your material, users may engage with it. Once the application has been downloaded, tap on the open button to launch the app open. Soon after you open up your account, you'll be able to see this login screen. Go to the bottom of the page and tap on the sign up link in order to sign up or create a new account. Tap on the sign up with phone or email option at the bottom or you can also sign up using your Facebook account. In my case, I'm going to choose the sign up with phone or email option at the bottom. Now, in order to continue signing up for your account, you first need to type in your phone or your email address. If you want to type in the phone number, simply tap on the phone option at the top, select your country code and type in your phone number in the text box and tap next. If you want to sign up with your email, Tap the email option and enter an email address for yourself that you'd like to create an account with. While typing in your email, make sure that you are typing in the email address correct. After you do so, tap next. You need to enter the confirmation code that has been sent on your email address. Open up your email service provider and check your inbox for your confirmation code. Once you find the confirmation code, type it in in the text box and tap on the next button. On the next page, add your full name so that your friends can find you on Instagram. Once you enter your full name, tap next. Create a password for your Instagram account in the text box and make sure only you have an access to the password. If you'd like to save the password in this device, make sure to check this little box that says save password and tap next. If you don't want to save your password, leave the box unchecked and tap next. On the next page, add your birthday information, select your year, month and day of your birthday and tap next. Enter your username that you'd like to set for your account. You must choose a unique username for yourself. If the username is available, you'll be able to know it right here. Once you have a username for yourself that is valid, you'll be able to see a green tick mark on the right corner. After you are done setting a username for yourself, tap next and tap on the sign up button at the bottom. If you've already registered with a Facebook account, you can tap on find friends to find your Facebook friends. Or if you don't want to do that, tap on skip. You need to sync in your contacts to find your friends. So tap on the next button at the bottom and allow Instagram access to your phone's contact by tapping OK. Now you can add a profile picture for yourself by tapping on add a photo on the next page. Select a picture for yourself or you can just skip the step right now and do this later by tapping skip at the bottom. Go ahead and follow some people from the discover people tab by tapping on the follow button and tap next at the top right. Soon after you do that, you have successfully created an Instagram account. Now you can simply go ahead and tap on the plus icon at the bottom and allow Instagram to access your photos and videos from your phone's library by tapping continue. In the pop-up, allow more access by tapping on allow access to all photos or only allow access to selected photos by tapping on select photos. From your library, select pictures that you'd like to post on your Instagram and tap on done at the top right. Soon after you select a picture or a video, tap next at the top right hand corner. Similarly, you can also create a stories, reels and go live from Instagram. That is how you can easily use Instagram on iPhone as a beginner. I hope the tutorial was helpful to you. If it was, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. I'll be back soon with more videos like this. Thank you for watching.